Hello and welcome again to Stocks Advisor channel. Here at our channel, we are looking for interesting buy opportunities for US based stocks. And today we will talk about Rocket Companies Incorporated traded at New York Stock Exchange ticker name RKT. Well, RKT is really very interesting stock for the moment, uh, showing very nice sequence of volatilities for the last uh, several months. You can see those waves going up and down, and they are proposing very interesting play. If you just wait enough you enter in time and you really do it well you can make it a very nice trade here so uh, let's do analysis to understand how to trade with RKT first of all what is important it's a company with let's say uh, the pattern that now shows a magic cross down we see today it's a situation when moving average 20 this green line hits from the top moving average 50 the blue line and as always at our daily charts we have moving averages depicted here. In this case, it's uh, 20 and 50 being green and blue line, 200 you don't have yet, since not enough data is still there. So what do we see for the moment? This is very interesting pattern. So we see now uh, the, the red candle today with a big upward shadow and smaller downwards and magic cross down. Still, the price was not low. So if it would be three days ago, you could say it's a delayed magic cross, but now it's a clear magic cross. And from technical point of view, the price should go lower further. So it should decline, which we should see it at least as a spike. And the first volatility trade should be in the vicinity of the low, previous uh, nearest low, which is uh, this uh, flying dragon uh, kind of uh, candle three days ago with very long downward shadow. So inside of this shadow, we might see the major volatility and possible reversive momentum. So it will be the buy in, in it. We will discuss it later. And uh, but we could decline. Should we go lower? Then of course it will be even better buy opportunity. For the moment, you could see that this is a technical decline because the moving averages are still volatile around each other, and there is no significant increase in volume being traded. If you look at these bars here, the volume is overall is the same, so it's, it is within the noise level, so it's quite okay. There is nothing dramatic taking place in that sense. This would be all the no our noise. Uh, level. So, how to play? And uh, as I said, the first entry would be immediately here in the in, inside of this uh, shadow uh, within the support levels that we'll now designate. And this would be just at also very strongly historically defined just below 1950 as an entry. And then the lower part would be here also very nicely historically defined this one which would would be about 1865 so let's uh, write it here then as a first entry uh, for us and uh, this is really interesting because once we confirm if confirmed tomorrow the major cross down it will be a very good entry opportunity especially given that the stock is very volatile it could make these big moves and it is actually uh, behaving really uh, technically at the moment. So this would be the first level to enter. And what we could still expect here, we know that the price has these volatilities. And if you look at the moment, what is we observing after having the previous top, at the level of uh, about 2550, we now have, okay, with one step extra, but declined and looks like it's decelerating. But with this magic cross down, it might be, it's just another step and then it will go further. So once we enter here, if we go even further, we just need to be prepared to enter again. And of course, then the next level to enter would be the lowest part we observe here. So it would be about 1780 uh, and anything lower it, it would be immediate buy in this case. And it would be anything that is actually uh, smaller than 1760 is immediate buy again and that's it so we have only two levels to buy because this is uh the, that rare case when we're already very in a very very bullish momentum here so we could uh, spike back any moment and once this is taking place you could make your profit but again uh, you don't need to be too greedy just make your profit in time we always we never discuss exit opportunities like price targets because this could be sometimes not achievable due to negative catalysts coming in and then it is not with line 
uh, in line with our mixed analysis. Therefore, we always uh, pro propose to take 10 to 15 percent profit from the money that are allocated in the stock. And that's the way we make the trade and also how we target and how we actually propose and um, provide our opinion videos. And what does it mean mixed analysis at our channel? It's the situation where we discuss actually three points, three pillars. First one is technical analysis. Second one is nonlinear averaging down based on resist support levels. And the third one is taking into account possible negative outcome of negative catalyst that might kick in any moment, which you cannot predict in design use. And of course, if you mitigate those three risks, then what remains for you is taking profit. And that's what we um, focus for. And uh, with this being said, actually, uh, it's already very uh, bullish momentum because it looks like we had already two steps of decline. So whenever we confirm tomorrow within this uh, first channel, let's name it S1, S2, the magic cross down, then it's immediate buy at S1, S2. And should we go lower, actually below S3, then it's just again immediate buy because then it will become very bullish at the moment. Of other parameters that say we are preparing for the jump is actually RSI. It still might go a little bit lower, but we see here that historically on those levels, it was always rebouncing for the last half a year. Speaking of MACD, it's even better. We are making now a second either shoulder, a small negative wave, which once it's resolved, upwards and we piercing to positive level should give us another spike. And this stock is indeed very spiky. You could see those spiking behaviors here and there all the time, uh, showing kind of triangles, but uh, also very volatile. So once this is the previous triangle was slightly uh, decreasing its uh, amplitudes, it spiked up. And now after sitting on it, we decline lower. So it should return to the pinpoint at least of this triangle. So it would be very nice trade here. Very simple this time, only two levels to enter and average down. And the strategy here is also very simple. It's one, two, meaning the funds you would like to play here, you can split in three actually. And then you buy with one in the designated level. And if needed, you average down with two portions again in the second circle. So this way it will be the best optimization for profit versus loss and should give you quite reasonable uh, profit for rocket companies. Overall, very interesting one to uh, watch and follow. We also will do it for coming days. So good luck with it. Also, please don't forget to subscribe to our channel if you're first time watching this video. Also, let's stay connected. You can find us on various social medias like Facebook, Instagram. There you can also see the new updates on the video. So um, let's stay connected there as well in order not to miss new interesting uh, discussions, opinions, and videos for us based market. With this being said, good luck with uh, Rocket Companies and see you at another episode of Stocks Advisor channel.